a brooch that's been worn by both Princess Diana and Camilla Parker Bowles. Kate Middleton just wore one of Princess Diana's most precious pieces of jewellery. On November 22, 2022, Prince William and Kate Middleton received the President of South Africa, Cyril Ramaphosa, on behalf of King Charles III. The royals first welcomed the President at the Corinthia Hotel in London, then proceeded to the Royal Pavilion for the official, ceremonious welcome. The annual visit included a horse-drawn carriage on the road to Buckingham Palace, a viewing of photographs in the Royal Picture Gallery, and a tour of Westminster Abbey. For the occasion, the Princess of Wales included one special touch to her attire that caught the attention of the public. As reported by Roy Anika, royal editor for the Sunday Times, Kate wore a plum purple Amelia Wixted collared dress. The Duchess accessorised her look with a feather brooch that belonged to her late mother-in-law, Princess Diana. The brooch was initially an engagement gift to Diana from Prince Charles's grandmother, the Queen Mother. Princess Diana first wore the brooch, which is more than a hundred years old, as a necklace at the Royal Opera House in 1982. Prior to Princess Diana acquiring the brooch, the item was gifted to the new Queen Alexandra of Denmark when she married King Edward VII in 1863 by the Ladies of North Wales, per the Beaumont. The main emblem depicts three ostrich feathers surrounding a crown, adorned with the words Ich dien, which is German for I serve. The cabochon emerald is also detachable. Princess Diana was reportedly last seen wearing the pendant in 1996, the same year she finalised her divorce from Charles. The king's current wife, Camilla Parker Bowles, has also worn the brooch on multiple occasions. Kate Middleton also wore another piece of Princess Diana's jewellery to complete her ensemble during the annual visit. The Princess of Wales was seen wearing the Collingwood Pearl Earrings, which were a wedding gift to Diana from Collingwood Jewellers, per the court jeweller. Of course, Kate frequently wears Princess Diana's jewellery. For instance, she subtly honoured Princess Diana at Trooping the Colour by wearing a piece from her collection, and she also honoured her late mother-in-law at the Remembrance Sunday service with her choice of earrings. In fact, Kate has been spotted wearing Princess Diana's diamond and pearl drop earrings on a regular basis, proving that she's very fond of her late mother-in-law's jewellery collection. As Prince William's wife, Kate is very respectful of the past. After Kate inherited the title of the Princess of Wales from the late Diana, a source told People, the new Princess of Wales appreciates the history associated with this role, but will understandably want to look to the future as she creates her own path. For the South African state dinner banquet, Kate paid further tribute to Princess Diana when she wore the Lover's Knot tiara. Reportedly, one of Diana's most beloved pieces, the late princess apparently so cherished the tiara that she put up with its heavy weight. Fashion expert Miranda Holder said on TikTok, because it was so heavy, she used to get terrible headaches from wearing it. You look beautiful. Of course I do, I'm a princess and this is my tiara! <laughs> In 1981, Princess Diana was loaned the Lover's Knot tiara by the Queen for her fairy tale wedding to Prince Charles. However, Diana famously chose to wear her family's tiara, known as the Spencer tiara, to her wedding instead. The Lover's Knot tiara was first made by Gerard Jewellers for Queen Mary in the late 20th century. It features 38 pearls, 19 of which are drop-down arches, and another 19 which are detachable spikes, per Reader's Digest. The twists on the tiara are called Lover's Knot Bows, which gives the tiara its iconic name. Princess Diana last wore the Lover's Knot tiara in 1991, while Kate Middleton has gone on to wear the item on multiple occasions, including to the annual diplomatic reception in 2015. As stunning as it is, it's easy to see why.